me to the book of First Samuel. First Samuel, chapter 30, 3, 0. Technical, you can help us also. Hallelujah. We'll start from verse 1. Amen. Say amen to that. And it came to pass. Technically, when you have it, please put it up. Amen. First Samuel chapter 30, verse from verse 1. Amen. Hallelujah. Are we there? And it came to pass when David and his men were come to Ziglag on the third day that the Amalekites had invaded the south and Ziglag and, and Ziglag and smitten Ziglag and burned it with fire and had taken the, the women captives that were therein. They slew not any, neither great or small, but carried them away and went on their way. So David and his men came to the city, and behold, it was burnt with fire. And their wives and their sons and their daughters were taken captives. Then David and the people that were with him lifted up their voice and wept until they had no more power to weep. And David's two wives were taken captives, Ahiom and Jezreel and Abigail, the wife of Nabal, the Camelite. And David was greatly distressed, for the people spake of stoning him, because the soul of the people was grieved, every man for his sons and for his daughters. But David encouraged himself in the Lord his God. And David said to Abiathar the priest, Abimelech's son, I pray thee, bring me hither the ephod. And Abiathar brought hither the ephod to David. And David inquired at the Lord, saying, Shall I pursue after this troop? Shall I overtake them? And he answered him, Pursue. For thou shalt surely overtake them, and without fail, recover all. Somebody say amen. amen. Somebody say amen. amen. I bring a message to you this morning, titled, Faith to Recover. Faith to Recover. Faith to Recover. Hallelujah. Faith to recover. Understand something. That as children of God, the Bible says, we walk by faith and not by sight. Second Corinthians 5 and verse 7. We walk by faith and not by sight. In other words, no matter the situation in life, amen, use faith because you are a child of of God. Hallelujah. Here is David. He went out. In his absence, the enemy came. They invaded his town. They burnt it with fire and took their wives, took their sons, took their daughters. Hallelujah. The Bible said David was deeply distressed. That when he returned, the people were so angry that David, see the enemy has come. They have taken all we had. They have burnt our properties. Took our wives, our children. 
The Bible said that the, that the people thought of stoning him. Can you imagine how much they were grieved? Someone say amen to that. But one thing I like about David, the Bible said David wept him and his people. The men that were with him, the mighty men of valor. Hallelujah. Amen. They wept until they had no more power to weep. Can you imagine such situation? There are times you face circumstances. That you weep, you weep. You complain, you complain. You cry. Sleepless nights. Pain. Sickness. It's like there is no help. You have to say, until they had no more power to weep. Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. Not only that, his own wives were taken. Everybody's wives were taken. Everybody's children were taken. To be slaves. A message to somebody. Yes, sir. All what they have suffered for, all what they have worked for, enemy came and stole it. That's why Jesus said an enemy has done this. Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. But one thing I love about David, he was not only a king, he also carried the anointing of a priest, the only king who was a king and a priest. Yes, sir. Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. But the Bible said, he turned to the priest in the house at that time. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. He said, give me the ephod. There is a time in life when you must take your position. I'm asking you to somebody. Yes, sir. There's a time in life when you take your position. Before they were crying. There's a time when it's time to dry your eyes and stop crying. I'm asking you to somebody. After you cry, cry. There's a time to say, I will cry no more. Hallelujah, somebody. David stopped crying. He went to the temple. He said, priest, give me the ephod. Now, the ephod, amen, is an apron that the high priest wear. I'm asking you somebody yes, to communicate to his God. Hallelujah. Amen. I'm asking you somebody. Yes, sir. I'm helping somebody here. Yes, sir. It's like I enter now, I go and take my robe, I put it on. I said, Today, that devil is a bastard. Amen. I'm asking you somebody here. Yes, sir. He was angry from his spirits. I'm helping somebody. Give me the ephod. You see, Bishop, 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 Bishop Ben Stephen, amen, was, was, was putting on the ephod. It's something you wear inside. I'm asking you somebody. David took it. He put it on. And the Bible said, and the inquirer of God. I'm helping somebody. Yes, sir. Today, I don't know your circumstance. Oh. But one thing I know is that the word of God, amen, is for you to use it. Amen. You have been crying for too long. Yeah. It's time to put on your pants. Ah. Today we will fight that fight. Amen. We will fight in the Lord. Amen. That's why Paul said, fight a good fight of faith. Yes, I'm asking you somebody here. Yes, you may have lost everything. Ah. You may have lost your marriage. Yes, you may have lost your money in the bank. Yes, you may have lost your helper. Ah. You may have lost what they gave you. Yes, you may have lost what your father gave you. Yes, when you are coming up, yes, your father Blessed you. Your father left things for you. Everything was going well. But at one time, things turned around. You begin to suffer. You see family taking your properties. You see uncle taking your properties. Auntie taking what belongs to you. People even go to voodoo place to kill you for properties. Am I helping somebody here today? There are people who are crying. They have been trying their best. But I tell you something that best was not enough. Somebody say, enough is enough. Enough is enough. Somebody say, enough is enough. enough, is enough. enough, is enough. Say, enough is enough. enough, is enough. I come enough. with an anointing today yes, to break that yoke upon your life. Amen. I come with an anointing today yes, that you may recover all. Amen. That you may recover all. Amen. That you may recover all. Amen. If only you can have faith. Yes, Hallelujah. Yes, David had faith. Yes, David had faith. Yes, he realized that Crying cannot bring back his wife. Crying cannot bring back his children. Crying cannot build the houses back. Crying cannot bring back everything they have lost. The Bible says he 
enter the temple. He said, Priest, give me the ebon. I want to pray. I want to pray. I want to pray. And let me declare to somebody whenever you are coming to church, don't just say, I am coming as an ordinary man. Come with somebody who is desperate. Come like somebody who is desperate. If you want to run to the altar and kneel down and say, Lord, I cry to you. This is the house of God. Come to the altar. Say, Father, I need your help. I'm asking you to somebody. The time has come that enough is enough that you should take back whatever they stolen from you, whatever the enemy stole from you. I said, take it back. I said, take it back. I said, take it back. Take back your marriage. Take back your business. Take back your children. So many parents are crying. I love my children. I love my daughter. I love my son. But they are saying, Lord, he has gone astray. Lord, she has gone astray. Help me. Many people are crying. They lost millions in the bank. They were seven. And they said there's a crash. The economy has crashed. People lost many thousands. Many people lost millions. I'm helping somebody here. But today, I come to help you. To show you the way forward. Amen. To help you. Amen. To show you the way forward. Amen. If David did it, you can do it. I said, if David did it, you can do it. One thing I have learned, the Bible said, God is not the respect of a person. It doesn't matter who you are, whether you are a man or woman, whether you are a boy or girl, whether you are white or black. It doesn't matter your nationality. God hears you. I said, God hears you. God hears you. If you can have faith today, Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. I see in the realm of the spirit, uh, God is releasing something to your hands. God is releasing something to your hands. The God, I said, God is releasing something in your hands. God is releasing something in your hands. God is releasing something in your hands. Somebody shout and receive it. Shout and receive it. Hallelujah, somebody. Hallelujah, somebody. Hallelujah, somebody. The Bible said from verse 8, it said, and David inquire of the Lord. David what? Inquire of the Lord. Hallelujah. I hear me. As you are standing, as you are sitting down, wherever you are, I want you to be inquiring of the Lord. Hallelujah. You know, take it back. I cry no more. We may endure for a night, but joy cometh in the morning. This is my time. This is my morning. I've been in darkness for too long. My time has come. From today, my light will shine. As from today, your light will shine. 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 In the name of Jesus, they have been covering you for too long. Until you almost think that you are a nobody. Until you almost think that you cannot do it. Until you almost think that nothing good can come out of you. I'm asking to somebody here. I'm helping somebody here. When Jesus appeared, there was nothing happening. Hallelujah, somebody. In the town called Nazareth. I'm helping somebody here. That even when Nathaniel go and found his brother, he said, can any good thing come out of this place? And he told him, say, come and see. From today, you will tell your brother, you will tell your sister, you will tell your family, you will tell your friend, you say, Come and see. 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 They may have been doubting you. They may have been talking about you. They may say nothing good can work for you. But from today, I profess up your life. They will come and see your victory. They will 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 see your victory. Your victory, then we see your victory. You are recovering all, you are recovering all, you are becoming all. They think you are a nobody from today. I promise I open your life. You are somebody. I say 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 you are somebody. I hear in my spirit the tide is turning, the tide is turning away, the tide is turning away, the tide is turning away. I 
said the rule is passed in your favor. God is favor with you. I said from today, receive favor. Receive favor. Receive favor for your property. Receive favor. Receive favor for your property. Whatever they have taken from you, I hear in my spirit. My God will give you double. 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 Somebody receive double. Receive double. Receive double. Receive double. Receive double. Chop up my shot. I receive it. Has come. Your time has come. I say your time has come. I say your time has come. One thing that interests me, God said, David inquire of the Lord. Hallelujah. Somebody help me put this in the corner. Amen. Somebody. Hallelujah. The way I respect money these days. Hallelujah. 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 David inquire of the Lord. Listen to me. From Genesis to Revelation, one thing I have discovered of the Lord, hallelujah, that whoever seek God, God answers their prayer. God answers their prayer. God answers their prayer. I say God answers their prayer. Today, God will answer your prayer. 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 Answer your prayer. Lift up your hands wherever you are. Say, Lord, answer me. Answer me. Answer me. Answer me. You are my helper. You are my helper. My only hope. My only hope. Oh Lord, my helper. Show up for me. Show up for me. In the name of Jesus. Pray for one minute. Pray for one minute. Pray for one minute. Pray for one minute. My name. In Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Listen, listen. In the time of Moses, the Bible said, whatever word, hallelujah. Holy Ghost is here. I say, Holy Ghost is here. I say, Holy Ghost is here. I say, Holy Ghost, is here. I say, Holy Ghost your time has come. 
in the time of Moses, when Moses tell the people they were waiting for us to see the miracle before they believe. Hallelujah. I might speak to somebody, but we are in the realm of the spirit. As we are in the realm of the spirit, as you believe, that sea is parting for you today. As you believe, that sea is parting for you today. That red sea is parting today. In the mighty name of Jesus, in the Old Testament, hallelujah, Moses had to divide the water, but in the New Testament, Jesus said, I am the God that created the heavens, that created the earth. The Bible said, in the book of Genesis chapter 1, hallelujah, hallelujah, somebody, that the earth was without form and void, and the water was everywhere. The Bible said, God parted the water, God divided the water, I said, God divided the water, he called the water sea, he called the dry land land. Hallelujah, somebody. That's why when Moses went to the Red Sea, God told him, don't you know I'm the one that departed it? I'm the one that put it in place. I will reshape it again for you. I will reshape the water for you. He said, Moses, stretch your rod. Stretch your rod. And part it. Hear me and hear me well. We make your hand like this. Part your Red Sea now. Part your sea now. Say, I part it. I part it. Be parted. Be parted. Be parted, be parted, be parted, be parted. Rada da 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 Jesus, right in there. The Bible said, in the days of Jesus Christ, hallelujah, when the, when the disciples, they went far in the boat, hallelujah, he arrived in the seashore, he was praying on the mountain, and the, the boat has gone far, hallelujah, because he's the one that made the water, hallelujah, somebody, he said, no, I am not in the Old Testament, now I am in the New Testament, let me show my children what I come to do. Let me show my people what I come to do. And I see there's somebody here. The Bible said Jesus did not pass the water. The Bible said he walked upon the water. He walked upon the water. I decree over your life. I prophesy over your life. From today, I don't care. It doesn't matter what they put for you. I don't care whether they make time for you. From today, every time is parallel. Every evil power is paralyzed. You shall walk over them. You shall walk over them with power, with audacity. I say, walk over them. 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 Enough is enough. I take my authority. I take my authority. I take my authority. I walk over powers. I walk over darkness. I walk over witches and wizards. As we are walking over them, we paralyze them. We paralyze them. We paralyze them. I can't tell them all. Mantaria Banana. Reba Banana. Rapataya. He had da 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 da. Mekatori Alaba. Holy Ghost. 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 He had a Banana Banana. He had a Banana. He had a Banana. I see somebody. I see somebody in the realm of the spirit. You we are bound and tied. But I just see that chain break. I just see that chain break. I just see that chain break. And I see somebody. You begin to lift up your hands. And you begin to jump. You begin to dance. You begin to celebrate. It's time to celebrate. It's time to celebrate. It is your season. It is your time. It is your hour. It is your moment. Your moment to shine. You have been one place for too long. They have stopped you for too long. They have over you for too long, but you are set free. You are set free. You are lost. You are lost. Somebody shout, I am moving forward. My God, my God, my God. Today is your day. Today is your day. I said, Today is your day. Hallelujah. 
point to your neighbor, say neighbor, say neighbor, say you have faith, say you have faith, you will win, you will win from today, you are a winner, 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 give five people high five, 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 you are a winner. 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 Oh, la bada bada. Lepe le bebe shota. Mato robo bosaya. Lika turia baba. Mato le boshete. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. In Jesus' name. Sit down. Sit down for a second. Mako turia baba. You come to receive today. The Lord said, I am here to release them. I'm here to bless them. In 2 Corinthians 4 and verse 13. 2 Corinthians 4 verse 13. It said, we having the same spirit of faith. So when I said you have faith, amen somebody, it is because it is written. Hallelujah. It said we. Somebody said we. He did not say pastors. He did not say pastors, only you. He said we. Somebody said we. Somebody say we. Say we. We having the same measure of faith. Hallelujah. Are we there? We having the same spirit of faith. It means the same power of faith. According as it is written. I believe. And therefore have I spoken. We also believe. And therefore speak. Hallelujah. According to the level that I believe. I have spoken. And that's. You all, amen, with your measure of faith also. You believe and therefore you speak. Am I speaking to somebody? There is power in speaking. There is power in positive confession. Yes, sir. There is power in positive declaration. Yes, sir. Hallelujah, somebody. That's why when something press you, amen, don't let that thing press you too long. Rise up, say from today, me too. I press you back. I press you again. I press you again. Are you sick? There is a time to be sick, but there is a time to be well. Yeah, I'm asking somebody here. Yes, sir. Are you down? There is a time to be down. There is a time to be up. Yeah, I'm helping somebody here. Yeah, there is summer time. There is winter time. Yeah, I'm helping somebody here. Yeah, there is heat. There is cold. Yeah, Hallelujah, somebody. Yeah, Are we together here? Yeah, there is singleness. There is marriage. Yeah, Hallelujah. Yeah, there is time to rent. There is time to own your own. I'm helping somebody here. I don't know who I'm talking to today. I don't know who I'm talking to today. I say your time has come. I say your time has come. I say your time has come. Time has come. Use the measure of faith God has given to you. You have it from today. Enough is enough to cry. Enough is enough to cry. From today, take the elements of salvation. Hallelujah, somebody. Which you have in you. Hallelujah, somebody. Put on the elements of salvation. Amen, somebody. Put on the breastplate of righteousness. You are righteous. Amen. Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. And I love this one. It says, take the shield of faith. Amen. Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. When you have your faith, you have your helmet on, you have your breastplate on, you put on the shield. Hallelujah. That tells you you are preaching the gospel. I'm asking you somebody here. No matter what the enemy throw at you, you are covered. You are protected. You are undefeated. You are moving with fire. You are moving with power. You are not afraid. No more fear. No more fear. No more fear. The Bible said, for God has not given us the spirit of fear, but of power. But of power and of a sound mind. People who have faith, they walk by faith. They have power. They have strength. You are not relenting. You are not relenting. You are pushing. You are pushing. Someone say, I'm pushing. Someone say I'm pushing. Say I'm pushing. I will not be stopped. I will not be stopped. I am unstoppable. I am untouchable. From today, I take my shield of faith. I take my shield of faith. I take my shield of faith. In the name of Jesus. 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 Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, Holy Ghost. I said today is your day. I said today, today. In Hebrews 10, Hebrews 10, 22 and 23. Hebrews 10, 22 and 23. 
said, let us draw near with a true heart in full assurance of faith. Hallelujah. Let us draw near with a what? A true heart in full assurance of faith. Amen. So in other words, the faith that you have in you, you must use it Amen. in full assurance. Amen. No doubt. Amen, Amen somebody. Amen. No doubt. Don't ask and doubt. You will not receive. As you ask, no one thing. You are not asking a man. You can ask a man. A man can disappoint you. I'm asking to somebody. But the one we are talking about, his name is Elohim. His name is El Shaddai. His name is El Leon. His name is El Shabbat. His name is Jireh. His name is Rafa. I'm asking to somebody here. His name is Jehovah. Hallelujah, somebody. There is nothing too big for God. There is nothing my God cannot do. I said, God will do it for you. I said, God will do it for you. Just have the full assurance. Hallelujah, somebody. Full what? Assurance. Don't doubt. Don't doubt. If God said, come and take, take it. I'm asking you, somebody. Receive it and believe it that I have received it. That settles it. No matter what the devil say anymore. No matter what people say anymore. Just say, mm, it is well. Amen. I say, it is well. Amen. Someone say, it is well. 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 It is well. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. It is well. Amen. When you have faith. Amen. It is well. Amen. When you are walking in Amen. faith. Amen. Someone say, hallelujah. hallelujah. Someone say, praise the Lord. Someone say, praise the Lord. Praise the, Lord. Praise the, Lord. the Bible said in James chapter 5, verse 15. James 5, 15. Hallelujah. James 5, 15. I like the B part. Amen. Say, and the prayer of faith shall save the sick. The prayer of faith shall save the sick. Hallelujah. And the Lord shall what raise him up. The prayer of faith shall save the sick. Do you see that secret? It is the prayer of faith. Hallelujah. When God used me to pray for you, it is a prayer of faith that I'm praying. And when you are receiving, it is faith you're also using to receive it. Amen, somebody. And as you receive it, you have it. As you receive it, you believe it. Faith is a substance of things hoped for. The evidence of things not seen. You actually don't see. You do not see it physically. Hallelujah. I'm helping somebody here. You have not seen it, but you just come. And I tell you, it is well. God said you have received it. God said the battle has been won. You are victorious. Am I helping somebody? Amen. All you do is receive it. As long as it has come from the man of God, I believe. Am I speaking to somebody? Know that when the word comes from the man of God, know that it is God that speaks to you. You don't see the man. You see the God that speaks through the man. Yes, sir. Am I speaking to somebody here? Yeah. You don't hear the man. You hear the God that speaks through the man. Yes, sir. Am I speaking to somebody here? Yeah. When you have such faith, God said, that's it. That's my daughter. That's my son. Because God wants to bless us. Am I speaking to somebody here? Yeah. Yes, but the key to the blessing is faith. Yes. The key to victory is faith. Amen. The key to healing is faith. Amen. The key to open doors is faith. Amen. The key to deliverance yes. is faith. Yes. Am I helping somebody? Yes. The key to recover all is faith. Yes. Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. Hallelujah, somebody. Say thank you, Jesus. Say thank you, Jesus. Why? Because you cannot pray and don't receive. It's not correct. We are not in a religious setting where we are just doing it because God said we should pray. Just pray just so that you can enjoy yourself. Pray, Father, help me. Father, Father. Yeah, da, da, da. No! Use faith. I'm asking you somebody. Let it proceed by faith. With 
full assurance. He said, full assurance of what? Faith. Full. He didn't say half. There is something called little faith. Little faith. Hallelujah. I must do somebody here. Amen. Go to Matthew 8, 26. In Matthew 8. Thank you, Jesus. Somebody say, thank you, Jesus. Somebody say, thank you, Jesus. Say, hallelujah. Are you receiving this morning? Are you receiving? We just cross into the afternoon. Are you receiving this afternoon? If you are receiving, say, amen. amen. Say, I hear, I hear. Amen. Say, I hear, I hear. In the name of Jesus. As you hear it, you are receiving. Amen, somebody. Jesus said, and he said unto them, Why are ye fearful? O ye of little faith. Then he arose and rebuked the wind and the sea. And there was a great calm. Hallelujah. They were in the ship. And the devil attacked them. The wind was boisterous. The sea was up and down as if the boat was about to capsize. Hallelujah. And the disciples were so afraid. They have to go down the boat to wake him up. He was resting. He was tired, resting. Hallelujah. And then they were, Master, 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 care not that we perish. Water is filling up the boat. Hold the sea. I believe Jesus wake up and say, Oh, you have little faith. He was stretching. <laughs> Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. Oh, you have little faith. Why you torment me all the time? He said, I have given to you faith. Use it. Use it. I'm teaching you. That's why I'm here. I've been doing all these things so that you can see. Use it. Exercise your faith. Bible said, and he rose and he rebuked the sea. I don't know what sea your boat is inside. I said, I don't know what sea your boat is inside. Today, you are going to rebuke it. Amen. I said, you are going to rebuke it. Amen. I'm asking you somebody. Yes, sir. As I rebuke it with you, you must also rebuke it. Amen. You see of failure. Amen. You see of delay. Ah. You see of singleness. Yes. You see of darkness. Ah. You see of sickness. Yes, sir. You, am I helping somebody here? Yes. You see of barrenness. I don't know what is your sea. Ah. Nothing good can happen. It's a sea. The devil is rocking you. Rocking you want to want to turn the boat upside and die so that you can drown and die. But the Bible said, He arose and rebuked the sea, and there was what a great calm. Today, I prophesy in your life. I prophesy in your life. I prophesy in your life. I prophesy in your finances. I prophesy upon your family. I prophesy in your marriage. I prophesy in your business. I prophesy in your education. I prophesy for your document. I prophesy for that location. I prophesy upon every area of your life. I prophesy there shall be a calm. I shall be a calm. I command peace be still. I demand peace be still. I demand peace be still. I demand peace be still. In the name of Jesus. 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 From today, you will move from little faith to abundance faith. And so you move from little faith to abundance faith. Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. That's what the Bible says. Faith cometh by hearing. Yes, and hearing by the word of God. Amen. As you keep on coming to church. Yes, as you keep on hearing the word of God. Amen. Your faith is increasing every day. Amen. Your faith is increasing every day. Amen. Where you fell yesterday. Amen. You go back today. Amen. I challenge you. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Now I come by faith. Amen. Yesterday I was weak. Amen. But today I am strong. Amen. I say yesterday I was small. Amen. Today I am big. Amen. Yesterday I know know nothing. That's why you use me. That's why you abuse me. Today I know something. Devil, you can't get me anymore. You can't get me anymore. I am now walking by faith and not by sight. Hallelujah, somebody. Hallelujah, somebody. Somebody say hallelujah. Somebody say hallelujah. Somebody say hallelujah. Somebody say hallelujah. There's another one called weak faith. Weak faith. Weak faith. Tell me Romans 4. Romans 4. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Are you receiving? 
Romans 4, verse 19. Say hallelujah. Romans 4, 19. And be not weak in faith. He considered not his own body now dead. When he was about an hundred years old, neither yet the deadness of Sarah's womb. Talking about our father Abraham. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The Bible said he, he was not weak in faith. Even though he was an hundred years old. Even though Sarah's womb was twisted. Everything dead and died. I'm asking to somebody here. There is no more womb. Scientifically, medically. Impossible. Hallelujah. But the Bible said still he was not weak in faith. I might be somebody. Maybe you have been strongly with this thing called faith. Today I am challenging you. Keep pressing on. Don't have weak faith. Don't say, oh, I can't make it. Don't say, oh, this sickness cannot go. Listen, whatever you confess is what you receive. Amen. If you have been confessing that it's impossible from today, turn it around. Amen. I hear, I hear. All things are possible Amen. to them that believe. Amen. I say, all things are possible to them that believe. Amen. All things are possible Amen. to them that believe. Amen. Do you believe? believe? Do you believe? I believe. Do you believe? believe? 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 If you live, shout, I believe. I believe. 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 What do you do to increase your faith? Number one, if you are not saved, receive Jesus Christ. Because it's when you receive Christ, the Spirit of God begins to work in you. Begin to strengthen your faith. The challenges will come, but the Holy Ghost will help you. Hallelujah, somebody. Number two, believe who God is and what he says he will do. Just believe it. Don't think it. The Bible did not say think it. Say believe it. Hallelujah, somebody. Hebrews 11.6. Hebrews 11.6. But without faith, it is impossible to please God. Say, he that cometh to him must believe that he is and that is the rewarder of them that diligently seek him. Amen, somebody. He that cometh to him must believe. Now that you are saved, you believe. Hello, somebody. As you are now a child of God, you are born of his spirit, you Amen. believe. Amen. You I believe. believe. Somebody I believe. say, I believe. I believe. Somebody I believe. say, I believe. I believe. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Number three, get more knowledge. Get what? More knowledge. Amen. Knowledge is power. Get more knowledge about God. Amen. The only way you can begin to receive from God is when your knowledge about God increases. You don't think God. I say you don't think God. Amen. Don't use perception. To assume for God. No way, no way. I'm asking to somebody. Don't take somebody's failure to be your own circumstance. Ah. Say, well, because it did not work for somebody, I don't think it will work for me. You are a child of God. Amen. I say, you are a child of God. Amen. I say, you are a child of God. Amen. God told Moses, he said, ask the people, is there anything too hard for me? Hallelujah, somebody. There is no impossibility with God. I might speak to somebody here. Amen. Now they come around that is passing around. They say, what God cannot do does not exist. It's true. Amen. I said, what well, posted it. What God... I pray as you post it, may you have that same faith in the name yeah. of Jesus. May you have that same faith in the name of Jesus. Yeah. May you have that same faith in the name of Jesus. Yeah. Don't just be the one that is passing it. You pass it, but you don't have it. Say, I receive it before I pass it. I receive it before I pass it. Amen. Don't just pass. Oh, let so, some people might think me too. I'm inside. No, you, you are not in line. Amen. Somebody, be in line by receiving it. I receive it. I'm to somebody. Amen. Be a testimony. Then you say, yeah. what God cannot do does not exist. Then I can yeah. send it to you now. I'm asking you somebody. What I have is what I'm giving to you. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Hallelujah. Yeah, man. Hallelujah. Somebody. Yeah, Hallelujah. Somebody. Yeah, Joshua chapter one verse eight. Somebody, if you are there, turn it quickly. Deuteronomy and Joshua. 
Hallelujah. Amen. Somebody say, where is Joshua? Are you there? Are you there? Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Number, Deuteronomy, and Joshua. Judges and Ruth. Praise the Lord. Somebody say, Amen. Joshua 1 verse 8. This book of the law shall not depart out of thy mouth, but thou shalt meditate therein day and night. I pause. This book of the law, the word of God, shall not depart out of your mouth, Amen. but you shall meditate upon it day and night. Amen. You read it, you meditate upon it. Amen, somebody. Amen. Let it digest. Mm, Let God. it digest. Let it my soak. God, my God, my God. You read it over and over, over and over. Mm. If it didn't work yesterday, try it again. It will work today. Amen. If it didn't work today, try it again. No, the word of God cannot lie. Amen. You go deeper again. Amen. I'm helping you. Mm. Go deeper again. There is something in this world I need to see. That, that thing called power. I may, I may have been looking at just an ordinary Bible. You just have some words. But this word, amen, that is that we, we, when we are teaching, we say it is logos. But they said it becomes rema. Rema is the power of God. It is the creative power of God. I mean, so somebody, I want to see the rema. I want it to come out of this word, to enter into me. I need it. Amen. I mean, so to somebody, go meditate, eat it, chew it, swallow it. I mean, so to somebody here. Say, no, I am not ordinary. This book must work for me. If I see it working for men of God, today, when I go, or today, as I see God, you will answer me, you will answer me, you will answer me. I hold on to your word. Don't give up. I may be somebody. Go deeper. You will see what you have never seen in this life. You will see God's creative power. You begin to get some insight and revelation. That you never experienced in life before. Yeah. Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. Amen. Meditate Amen. there in day and night. Then thou shalt make, that, say, that thou mayest observe to do according to all that is written therein. Amen. So as you meditate upon it, you also observe, make sure you are doing. Amen, somebody. We are doers of the word. Amen. You Amen. do it. So you are meditating at the same time you are doing. Amen. Check your life. Am I doing the word? Am I living the word? This word. What is it that is causing it not to work for me? Father, what is it? Search. What, 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 what? Psalm 51 says, search me, O God, and see if there be any other way in me. Amen. Father, what is it? I want this word to work. Listen, listen to me. I, I speak in your life. If you get to that level, there is something that will be built up in the inside of you. You will come out of that your closet. You will come out of your study room. You will be walking as a giant. I'm asking to somebody. You might look like the same person, but inside of you, something is, is triggering inside. Because you know what you have seen in the world. You know what you have felt in the world. I'm asking to somebody. Oh, you, you, be, you become a walking giant. You are walking, your spirit is praying. You are walking, something is happening. People will be looking at you and say, There is something different about you. What is it? He said, It is well. He said, It is well. Sometimes you begin to keep it in the inside. You keep it. I, my manifestation will speak. Amen. My manifestation will speak. Amen. My manifestation will speak. Amen. I'm asking you somebody here. Yeah. Result is the answer yeah. of what you have been doing in the, in the, in, in the secret. Yeah. I'm asking you somebody here. Yeah. Yeah. After today, you will have results. Amen. You will produce results. Amen. You will produce results. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. that thou mayest observe to do according to all that is written therein. Oh. For then, hear this. For then, Amen. Thou shalt make thy way prosperous. Amen. For then thou shalt make thy way prosperous. Amen. Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. And then thou shalt have good success. Amen, amen somebody. Amen. So as you read, you meditate. Amen. It's a, it will make your way prosperous. But it does not stop there. There are different levels of prosperity. Hallelujah, somebody. He said, then thou shalt have good success. Amen. Amen. I see success coming away. Amen. 
I see success in all you do. I see success in your finances. I see success in your business. I see success in your education. I see success in your marriage. I see success in whatever you do. The Bible said, and whatsoever he doeth, prosper. Whatsoever you do from today, prosper. Receive divine prosperity. Receive divine prosperity. Receive divine success. The Bible said, Colossians 1 27, Christ in me, my hope of glory. From today, Christ in you, your hope of glory. Christ in you, your hope of victory. Your hope of success. Christ in you, your prosperity. Christ in in you, your healing, Christ in you, your joy, rise up to your faith, rise up to your faith, and make a joyful voice to the Lord, let the devil hear you, let the heaven be put to shame, make a joyful voice unto the Lord, make a joyful voice unto the Lord, just shout, 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 My God, my God, my God, my God, my God, my God, in Jesus' mighty name, say my father, my father, say my father, my helper, in the name of Jesus, as I stand up and pray, I thank you for your word, I thank you for your word, I thank you for your word, faith to recover, from today, as I pray, I increase my faith, I increase my faith, I increase my faith, and as I pray, I recover all, I recover all, whatever is delayed in my life, whatever has been stolen from me, I recover all, in the name of Jesus, put your hands together and pray, put your hands together and pray, 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 pray. Somebody pray. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Now lift up your hands, begin to thank him. As we're about to move into the communion. We are taking the communion by faith today. Begin to thank him for his word. Begin to thank him for his word. Thank him for somebody. Somebody thank him. Somebody thank him. Somebody thank him. Thank him, somebody. Thank him, thank him, thank him. You have done many things in our life, Lord Jesus. Thank him, thank him, thank him. Thank you, you are the Thank you, thank you, thank you. You were buried in our place. Amen. As you rose again, you said, We have risen together with you. Amen. And put us together to sit with you Amen. in heavenly places. Yes, Thank you, Father, for the uplifting. Thank you, Lord. Thank you Father, for the recovery. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father, for the increase of faith. Thank you, Lord. Thank you Father, for healing. Amen. There is healing power in this place. I, I, I see it and I sense it in my spirit. Amen. Wherever you are sick, if you or if you are feeling sickness, wherever you are. Lay your hands there. If you have pain on your shoulder, I see, I see shoulder pain. It's going. If it's your stomach, put your hand in your stomach or your head or your heart. Thank you, Holy Ghost. The blood is powerful. It's touching somebody right now, right here in this place. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. I command Amen. every devil of pain, Amen. every demon of sickness, Amen. I charge you now. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. come out of their bodies. Amen. Come out of their bodies. Amen. You are not permitted to stay anymore. Amen. I rebuke you now. Pain go. Amen. Muscles pain go. Amen.
out. Come out. Come out. Every blood disease. Be healed. Be healed. Every cyst. Go. Every lungs problem. Disappear. Cancer. Die. Die. Sickness and disease. Die. Sickness is not permitted for the children of God. You have your miracles right now. You have your miracles right now. Someone receive it right now. Someone receive it right now. 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 In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Now by faith, begin to check yourself. Begin to check yourself. If it was your hand, move your hand. If it was your leg, move your leg. If it was your stomach, shake it. It's gone. It's gone. I say shake your body. Shake your body. It's gone in the name of Jesus. That headache is gone. The same way you come, you are going a different person in the name of Jesus. Check yourself right now. Somebody check yourself. Check yourself. Check yourself now. Check yourself now. I see this and this cannot stay. Check yourself. Check yourself. Check yourself. I said, check yourself now. Amen. Check yourself now. I'm not praying religious prayer. I have released it. It is yours right now. Amen. I stand in my office Amen. as an ordained apostle Amen. that is sent to heal. Amen. He said, heal the sick. Amen. Deliver the oppressor. Amen. Set the captives free. Amen. You are free in the name of Jesus. Amen. Now check yourself. Amen. Check yourself. Amen. If your head was hurting, I said it is gone. It is gone. Hallelujah. As you check yourself, hallelujah. Examine yourself. The Bible said, examine yourself. Examine yourself right now, not tomorrow. Right now, examine yourself. If you came in with a sickness, with an ailment, with pain or anything, hallelujah. Now, wherever you are, hallelujah. If you, if you know you are, you, are, you are different now, lift up your hand. Wherever you are, just know that, oh, I feel it. I feel it. I feel it. Hallelujah. I came with the problem. It is gone. It is gone. I, I'm treating you now out to exercise your faith. Hallelujah. It's always work. It's always work. Hallelujah. 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 You know you are you are not the same anymore. Come here quickly. Come here quickly. Come here quickly. Come here quickly. Hallelujah. Somebody, you know, you know you come with that pain. Check yourself right now and come here. Quickly, quickly, quickly. I'm about to pray. You came with the pain, and as the prayer goes on, you know that wow, I felt it. Hallelujah! 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 What was your problem? Come, come, can I get a mic? Son, come. What was your problem? Because God told me that He's healing right now. What was your problem? You were feeling pain. Hallelujah! How are you feeling right now? Pardon me? Pardon me? You feeling good? The pain is not there anymore. Amen. The pain is not there anymore. Come here, step forward. It is permanently in the name of Jesus. It is permanent in the name of Jesus. No more. It shall never return again. Clap for Jesus, somebody. What was the problem? You have pain on your left leg. Uh huh. As I was praying, you begin to exercise it. You couldn't feel it anymore. Come here. Come here. Come here. Somebody clap for Jesus. Celebrate when Jesus is doing the work. Celebrate when Jesus is doing the work. You can the same way you came. Hallelujah. Yes, mama, what was the problem? What was the problem? This morning when I wake up, I feel my back. Mm -hmm. I even wake up earlier. Mm -hmm. I didn't mean that I would come to church today. So you woke up and you were feeling back pain. You didn't even think you were coming to church. When I'm walking, it's, it, it's, it's just like I'm going back. Home. So when you are walking, it's like you are going back or the pain was pulling you as the prayer was going on. Now what happened now? What's up when, now? When Pastor said anybody that comes here with pain, let him or her put her. Uh -huh. I put my my right hand on my back. Mm -hmm. I spread. Mm -hmm. I spread like this. Mm -hmm. So when I mm -hmm. bow down now, mm -hmm. I said three times. Mm -hmm. when the man of God said, "Let me let us come out." Mm -hmm. My way of coming, I feel something like it. On my back. Somebody shout hallelujah. hallelujah. Amen. As the prayer was going on, she used faith, she 
put her hand there and she did it three times and as I was calling, amen, she was walking here and as she was walking she just felt something sharp that, that is, is gone, amen. it's gone it is called the walk of faith it shall never return in the name of Jesus amen. somebody clap for Jesus, amen. somebody celebrate Jesus, amen. that's the that's power of God you are permanently here you are, that's the power of God, hallelujah what was the situation? Oh, I, I call cramp. Yeah. So you were the one with the cramp. So for the past week, you were having cramps. Okay, so what happened now while the prayer was going on? The, the, um, when I came here Tuesday, Apostle prayed for me. Yeah, I know you were here on Tuesday. I prayed for you. Uh -huh. My chest feel like when I'm swallowing water, drinking water, mm -hmm. like I feel a big knot here. Like so when you are swallowing water before, it's like, like, it's like a big knot or something inside. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So since that day, the yeah. prayer, you can swallow now. And what about the cramp? The cramp is, the cramp is gone. Amen. Do this for me. Do this for me. Hey. Do this for me. Somebody ah. shout Jesus. Amen. Somebody say hallelujah. 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 Hey. hallelujah. Hallelujah. Some of you, the Lord said to tell you, as you we are going, as you are living here now, amen, you are receiving your miracle. Amen. You are receiving your miracle amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. That's how you exercise faith. Amen, amen. somebody. I said, never again amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Even if I did not call your case, no, have confidence, amen, somebody, that it is settled. Rise up on your feet.